balancing of equations involving redox reactions. There are two different methods. Today we are going to see how we can balance equations using iron electron method or half reaction method, sometimes called half cell method. Step one of the reaction. Find the elements whose oxidation numbers have changed. Choose a substance that acts as an oxidizing agent and one that acts as a reducing agent. Today we are going to see the example of the reaction between Fe2 positive with manganate ion MnO4 minus reacting in an acidic medium to produce Fe3 positive and Mn2 positive along with some water. First thing to do is write the equation. Identify those elements that are undergoing change in oxidation. Write down the oxidation numbers of the reactants and products. Two is the oxidation number of iron. Seven is the oxidation number of manganese and manganate ion. Three is the oxidation number of Fe3 positive. And positive two is the oxidation number of Mn2 plus. In order to determine oxidation numbers, you may refer to my earlier video on how to assign oxidation numbers. Whenever there is an increase in oxidation number, the reaction is considered to be oxidation. Fe2 plus changes to 3 plus, so this is an oxidation half reaction. In this case, one electron is lost from Fe2 plus to change into Fe3 plus. Manganese and manganate ion changes into Mn2 positive. The oxidation number decreased by 5 units, which means it needs to gain electrons or it is a reduction half reaction and we have to provide 5 electrons for it. So we have identified the oxidation half reaction and reduction half reaction in this reaction. Fe gets oxidized and Mn gets reduced. Fe2 positive is the reducing agent as it gets oxidized. So all oxidizing agents gets reduced in a redox reaction, which implies MnO4- is the oxidizing agent and it is getting reduced in the process. The next thing to do is normally separate the equations into two half reactions. Identify the oxidation half reaction, identify the reduction half reaction. In this case, Fe2 plus changing to 3 plus plus 1 electron. Reduction half reaction, MnO4 minus plus hydrogen ions plus 5 electrons giving you Mn2 plus. We may also look at the same reaction in a slightly different way just to get an idea of what's going to happen. In order to do that, we will see what we should be doing. Balance the half reactions. Balance all atoms other than hydrogen and oxygen. Calculate the oxidation numbers on both sides of the equation. Add electrons to whichever side it is necessary to make up the difference and make sure both half reactions have gained equal number of electrons or lost equal number of electrons. Balance both sides so that the total charge on the left and the right are the same. To balance oxygen atoms, add water molecules on the side deficient in oxygen. And on the side deficient in hydrogen, add H positive ions because the reaction is being balanced in an acidic medium. This is the reduction half reaction, oxidation half reaction. Oxidation half reaction produces one electron and we need 5 electron in the first equation. Therefore, we multiply the oxidation half reaction by 5 so that we have 5 moles of electrons. Add the two reactions, you have a balanced equation. Now, we can take a slightly different look or slightly different approach to the same reaction. We have done this earlier. Identify the oxidation numbers, oxidation half reaction, reduction half reaction. 
if you multiply the oxidation half reaction by 5, it will produce 5 electrons. The reduction half reaction requires 5 electrons. So we have generated 5 moles of electrons by taking 5 moles of Fe2+. Plus. Or we have to add a coefficient for Fe2+. Plus. That's the 5 moles of electrons that we need. If you have 5 moles of Fe2 plus on the reactant side, we also need 5 moles of Fe3 plus on the product side. Since the number of manganese ions on the left and right are same, we're not changing the coefficient since it's 1, remains the same. Next, we have to balance oxygen. On the left side, we have 4 oxygen atoms in manganate ion. According to the ion electron method, we need to have 4 moles of water on the product side. So we will add 4 moles of water. What remains to be balanced at this time is hydrogen ions. Since we have 8 hydrogen ions, hydrogen atoms on the right side, we need to have 8 hydrogen ions on the reactant side. So add the required quantity of acid. Now we have a balanced equation. So fundamentally, we have separated the oxidation half reaction, reduction half reaction, and added them up together. And this is very similar to the oxidation number method. But when you write it, we tend to separate the two half reactions, write them separately, and add them up. If on the reactant side and the product side you have similar elements or compounds, cancel them. In the above example, we don't have any such atoms or molecules. Therefore, the equation is actually balanced. So 5Fe2 plus plus MnO4 minus plus 8H positive gives you 5Fe3 plus plus Mn2 plus plus 4H2O. That's a balanced equation. Since we have hydrogen ions in the reactant side, indicates that the equation has been balanced in the acidic medium. Here are some examples for you. Write down the questions, balance them, and check whether you're getting the right answers. Pause the video to write these. Please subscribe, like, and rate the video. If you have any questions or comments, please do post them. Thank you and have a great day.